All right, we're gonna start out with trunk twisters. Um, so I'm subbing for Andy today. Obviously, I'm not Andy. <laughs> um, I think she might be on vacation. I'm not sure, but um, I'm just subbing for her. I was supposed to sub last Saturday, but I got um, well, I got a new horse, and so things were kind of crazy. So I think Jillian subbed for you guys. So I'm subbing this week, and then I think she's back. So um, yeah. All right, squats. So I think everyone's style is kind of a little bit different. Um, I don't know if anyone took my class last night. Um, probably not. I feel like everyone has kind of their own participants. But um, the workout I did last night, we're going to do today. So got a little bit of strength, a little bit of cardio, um, some abs, all full body stuff. So should be a good workout. All right, let's go lunge with an overhead reach now. So you're just gonna lunge forward and then bring those hips forward, get a nice stretch in your hip flexors and then push back, alternate sides. I apologize for the clutter too. This is like my mom's, she puts the, the dogs in here when she goes on a walk. Like, oh my God, it looks so bad. It's like cluttery. Ah, oh well. Nice. All right, let's go knee hugs now. Woo. Knee hugs. Bring that knee all the way into your chest. Nice. So, disclaimer. I threw my back out like I think it was like a week ago now and I have an elbow issue so I'm going to be modifying some exercises um but I'll tell you what they are they're really I mean they're self-explanatory I'm sure you've done them before so <clears throat> I may be doing them a little bit differently but um I think you guys all should probably know like squat jumps for example I'll do like an air squat stuff like that all right, quad stretch with an overhead reach. Let's alternate sides. Ooh, nice. Good job. All right, let's go eyes wide T's now. I'm gonna open up those shoulders. Oh, I, Y, T. Nice. Oh, my shoulders. I'm getting old. Not even old, but I feel old. Nice. All right, let's hinge at the hips now. We'll walk ourselves down. It's going to be an inchworm to push up. So you just hinge at the hips, walk yourself down. I'm going to skip the push up. But you should do a push up right here and then walk yourself back up. Oh my gosh. Hinge at the hips. If you can, keep those legs straight. I am like so stiff. Oh. Happy Saturday, too. I don't know if I said that. I feel like all the days get kind of blurry at this point. Oh. Nice. All right. Let's go on our stomach. We're going to make a T with our hands. And then, whew, scorpion. So, you're going to bring that opposite foot all the way over to that hand and just alternate sides. Try to keep those shoulders firmly on the ground. Nice. Good job.
This is like one of my favorite stretches. A lot of people don't like it. I don't know why. All right, so next, child's pose to cobra. So you're just gonna sit back in those heels into that child's pose, and you'll pop up into that cobra right there. Child's pose. And then pop up into that cobra. I might skip it. My elbow, it's just like not good. <laughs> nice. A couple more. All right, last but not least, let's get some jumping jacks going. I, again, have to modify my low impact jumping jacks. Just get that heart rate up. <clears throat> the good thing about me throwing my back out, I think, is that if anyone else is experiencing back issues or elbow issues, this could be potentially helpful because I don't think I'd go through these modifications if I didn't throw my back out. So, not that people would be working out that threw their back out, but. <laughs> Whew. All right, we should feel warm, um, heart rate up, all that good stuff. So, we're going to start out. Um, so, we're going to start out with a superset pod. So, three exercises, a minute each. We'll go three times through. We're gonna start out with Bulgarian lunges. So <clears throat> what you'll do is if you have a chair, get it. I'm just using a bench. So you're gonna put that back foot on the bench and then we're just gonna go into Bulgarian lunges. Modification, you can always keep your foot on the ground, do like a static lunge up and down. Um, after that, we're gonna go into a wall sit to make sure you have access to a wall. And then the third exercise is gonna be an ab one. I'll go through that when we get there. It's really self-explanatory, so. All right, and then for the Bulgarian lunges, you can grab weights if you want. I'm just gonna go body weight, but feel free to do whatever works. Let me just get that timer going. <clears throat> All right. All right, we'll go in three, two, one. Let's go, Bulgarian lunges. Try to lunge all the way down, hamstrings parallel to the floor, chest up. I'm going a little slow-mo just because of everything that's kind of out of whack. But <clears throat> if you have weights, this is probably a good cadence. But if your body weight, you know, try to get, try to get those reps up. Ooh. All right, switch sides. Doing great. I love Bulgarian lunges. They're one of my favorites. I feel like I always get sore from these. Nice job. 10 more seconds. Three, two, one. Find that wall. We're going to go wall sit. I've been using the TRX to do a little pseudo wall sit. Ready? Let's go. Find that wall, do your wall sit. I'm using a TRX just to make sure my back isn't too in it. I'm hold the wall sit for a minute. I think Andy does 45 or 50 second intervals, which are great. Uh, sometimes I'll do that, but usually I'll do 60 second intervals, so it might be a little different. 30 more seconds. Hamstrings again, parallel to the wall. Your pelvic tilt should be engaged on that wall. Belly button drawn into that wall, so that if I were to put my hand through your back, I shouldn't be able to get my hand through there. 
Ten more seconds. Five, four, three, two, woo! All right, good job. So now we're gonna go on our back. We're gonna go hand to heel. <clears throat> like so for 15 seconds. Then from there, we're gonna go into a bicycle kick on that same side. I'll walk you through it. All right, ready? Let's go. All right, now extend that leg. Opposite elbow to me. 15 seconds of this. Woo wee. And switch sides. Breathe. Try to get that hand all the way down to your heel. And extend that leg. Opposite knee to elbow. Doing great. Oh my goodness. And time. Good job. All right, that's one round. We're gonna go back to those Bulgarian lunges. Let's get ready. Woo! Put this right here. All right, we're gonna go in three, two, one. Let's go. Bulgarian lunges. So that's the circuit. We just go two more times through. <clears throat> Basically, I'll do like a superset, like a lower body superset. Do a little Tabata or an AMRAP to get your cardio in. Followed by like an upper body superset and then do abs at the end or like a 30, 60, 90. I think Angie's done kind of all these formats with you, but. All right, switch sides. Hang in there, you're doing great. I know this is, an, Angie has like the coolest garage. I don't know if it's a garage or like a gym, but oh my God, it's like, it could totally be on like a, a workout channel or something. It's pretty cool. I was doing my backyard, like I have a good backyard view. I was doing that for a while, but it got so hot. Time. Good job. Sorry, I was talking. Um, okay, waltz it. Let's get it. We're going to go in five, four, three, two, one, let's go. Yeah, I was doing it outside and then it got really, got really hot. No bueno. Hang in there, I know your legs are hurting. It is hard. Hang tight, breathe through it. You need to take a break, take a break. Ooh. Oh, moly. 25 more seconds. You got it. Ten to go. Five, four, three. Two, nice job. All right, hand to heel and out bicycle. Let's get it. We're gonna go in five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, hand to heel. 15 seconds, hand to heel. 15 seconds, out bicycle. So if my right hand is touching my heel, my right heel, then I'm gonna extend my right leg, and then left 
Elbow hits right knee. Sometimes it can be a little confusing. Shoulder blades off the ground. Woo! And switch sides. Doing awesome. Just have that hand support your neck and your head. Extend that leg now, we go ab bicycle. Oh my God, my abs are on fire. Ooh, in a good way. And fuego. You got this. Nice. Really good job. And time. All right, one more time through and then we move on. Really good job. All right, we're going to go in about three, two, one. Let's go. Chest up, hamstrings parallel to the ground. You got it, you got it. Ten more seconds. Yeesh. Three, two, one. All right, switch sides. Is Angie an Arnold? I feel like she was an Arnold for the fourth. I'm not sure if she's still up there or not. I saw her through the week at Mobius. She might, maybe she's going for the weekend. Also, if you come into the gym, I, I think I'm subbing her 5.30 a.m. and 6.45 on Tuesday. And time. Good job. Last round of wall sits. So interesting. It's so hard to wake up at like 5 to work out. I struggle with it. Like I'll try to do it. It's hard. All right, ready? Wall sits. Your leg should be screaming. It's been really interesting, like the demographic that, like, the morning classes in person at Mobius, they used to be packed. And now, although it is starting to pick up, it was interesting, like, I think the evening classes might have been more packed than the morning classes. Um, like, coming out of the stay-at-home stay order. And like weird hours that are usually like really vacant, like have been packed, it's so weird. I don't know if it's because people are working from home, different hours. 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, nice job. All right, hand to heel, at bicycles. Last one. And we're going to go into an AMRAP, my favorite AMRAP, the M100. It's really hard, but it's really good. All right, we're going to go in three, two, one. Let's go hand to heel, hand to heel. Get it, get it. Living our best life. Oh, my goodness. All right, now extend your leg at bicycle. Really good job. And switch sides. Woo, I'm dying. You got it, stick with it, stick with it. And extend that leg. That bicycle. Get those shoulder blades up, Sh uh, elbow to knee. Oh my goodness. Feel it. And time. All right, good job. So. Um, lower body strength is out of the way. 
We're gonna go into the AMRAP. So the AMRAP is five minutes, it's as many rounds as possible. I keep the rep numbers um, pretty consistent. So it's gonna be 10 squat jumps, 10 kickouts, 20 mountain climbers, as many rounds as you can do. I have to modify, actually I have to modify all three, but I'm gonna show you one of each just so I can, you can, you don't know what they are. So, um, so 10 squat jumps, all the way up, down, 10 of those. Then you're gonna go 10 kick outs, right here. So it's basically a burpee without the push up, back down and so forth. And then mountain climbers, you guys know that one? I think right here. So I'm just gonna modify those because of my back, but you guys have at it, it's good. Ready? We're gonna go right now. Squat jumps, let's go. Five minutes is starting right now. Three, four, five, six, seven, Go to 10. Now go kickouts, 10 kickouts. I'm gonna modify it, so I'm just gonna do it on a bench. I feel so pathetic. Then once you're done with that, go back to the squat jump. As many rounds. Woo! Get it. We're about a minute and 20 seconds in. It'll be over before you know it. Off like a band-aid. Breathe. This is hard, you gotta get your cardio and get that heart rate up. How many rounds can you do in that five minutes? Got it, stick with it. I'm on round two, where are you at? I'm sweating and I'm doing like totally modified versions, so you guys should be dying in a good way. Good news is, we are more than halfway through. We hit the two minute and 30 second mark. We're past that. Good job. It's all downhill. Kind of. <laughs> I would say in my heyday, I could probably get out five rounds in five minutes. Lately, it's been more like four. How many rounds can you do? Can you beat that? We got less than two minutes to go. Let's get it, let's get it. This incline, this is how I start everybody off on like push up, all sorts of stuff. You just decrease that angle of difficulty. Nice job. Guess what? We got about 65 seconds to go. Hang in there. You got it. Get those squat jumps, kickouts, climbers. 
10 squat jumps, 10 kick outs, 20 mountain climbers. Woo, 50 seconds to go. 45 now. Is it just me or does anyone else feel like the squat jumps are like the active rest of the whole AMRAP? And I really do feel like that.
Ooh, hip raise to a leg drop. Ready? Let's go. Hip raise, leg drop. Hip raise. Ooh, that feels good. Leg drop. If you want, you can bring those feet all the way back. Get a nice stretch. Ooh. And then slowly lower. Oh, that feels good. I should do that more. All right. 30 seconds down. Now, put your um, legs like a butterfly position. We're going to go sit-ups. Last 30. So it's a 30-30 split. This is a great um, ab exercise for people that have back issues. The butterfly position, it takes pressure off your back. And time. Woo! All right. One down. We got two more to go. Um, push up knee to elbow. Let's get it. We're going to go in three, two, one. Let's go. Push up knee to elbow. I might take the push up out just because my elbow, but I'm, I'm with you in spirit. Push up, knee to elbow. Got it. Keep going, keep going. Thirty more seconds. Twenty five to go. Push up, knee to elbow. Hang in there. If you get tired, take a break and then just get right back to it. Three, two, one. Nice job. All right, moving on, moving on. We got the lap pullover and the dips. Let's get it. So we're going to go in three, two, one. Let's go. You guys can see me. Oh. There we go. Woo! Feels good. I love this one. Squeeze that booty. Nice. Keep going. How are we doing on time? Whoop. Skull pressures. Bend those elbows. Doing great. Hang in there. And time. Good job. All right. Leg drop with a hip raise. 30 seconds. Then we go butterfly crunch. 30 seconds. Hold that in three, two, one. Let's get it. Hip raise, leg drop. Oh. Oh my God, this feels so good on your back. It's a great back stretch and then the eccentric lowering of those abs. It's so good for your abs. Slowly lower, vertebrae by vertebrae. And time. Put that dumbbell aside. Butterfly position. 
position. Sit-ups. Let's get them. Guys, you're doing great. Hang in there. Woo-wee! One more round after this. You're doing awesome. And time. All right. Last round. We got this. We got this. Woo. I love the Andy clap. I don't know if she does that online, but I love when she claps. It makes me happy. <laughs> All right. Ready? Let's go. Push up. Knee to elbow. Go. Push up. Knee to elbow. I'm going to take the push up out, but I expect you guys to do it. Unless it hurts. Don't do anything that hurts you. That is like rule number one. Thou shalt not trade through pain. We have these 10 training commandments at the gym and it's from Ben Bruno. He's a great celebrity trainer. And the first commandment of training is thou shalt not train through pain. It's true, you gotta listen to your body. Ten more seconds. Come on, come on. Five, four, three, two. Hell yeah. All right, two more minutes to go. And then we move on to Tabata. Get our last little cardio burst in. And then we just have a little bit of abs at the end. And you guys will be all done. So we're going to go in five, four, three, two. One, lap pullovers in that static glute bridge position. Whoop. Doing great, hang in there. Biceps to ears, keep those arms nice and straight. And squeeze that booty. Like you're squeezing a quarter. Woo! Come on. And skull crushers. Hinge at the elbows. Get a nice squeeze in those triceps. Elbows should be parallel with your arm. Don't let your elbows flare in or flare out. They're just like your knees. You got to take care of them. Which is probably why I have elbow pain. Ugh. Five, four, three, two. All right. Leg drop, kick raise. Last minute. And then we got that butterfly. 30 30 split. We're going to go in three. Two, one, let's go. Hip raise, leg drop. Oh, that hurts, you guys. My abs. Oh, my goodness. Ooh, nice job. And let's go, butterfly sit up. We're in that home stretch. Woo! Oh my goodness. Five, four, three. Two, one. All right, Tabata time. So, 20 on, 10 off, eight times through. You guys, I think Angie probably does a lot of Tabata. Um, 
So I'm going to have you guys do split squat jumps today. Um, for the first four, the second four will go plank up downs. I don't know why I was doing it like that. Um, so you can put the dumbbell away, catch your breath, get a quick sip, and then we'll get that Tabata on. I might have to modify, but we'll see. Again, if you have like a jump rope, you can do jump rope or like access to a cardio machine, use that, but whatever you want to do. We're going to go in three, two, one. Let's go. So this is the split squat jump right here. Whoop. Keep going, keep going. Three, two, one. Nice job. One down. We're going to go in three, two, one. Let's go. Number two. Three, two, one, two down. Doing good. Should be out of breath. All right, we're gonna go in three, two, one, number three. Three. Two, one, hang in there. Time. One more to go on the split squat jumps. You guys are doing great. We go in three, two, one, go. Ten more seconds. Time, good job, we're halfway through. Plank up, downs. Ready? And go, elbow to hand. Hold on. I'm gonna have to modify. <laughs> Three, two, one time. We got three more to go. Hang tight, hang tight. We go in three, two, one, let's go. We're alternating sides on those plank up downs. And time. Two more to go. Almost there. We go in three, two, one, go. Final two, final two. You got this. Ten more seconds. Three. Two, one. All right, last one coming up. Doing great. We go in three, two, one. Let's go. Last one. Final push. You got it. Oh, man. And time. Good job, you guys. Woo! All right. We're just going to finish off with some planks, and then we'll call it a day. So we're going to go hold um, a full front plank, and then we'll go side to side. So get ready. Catch your breath, but get ready. We're going to go in 
Nice. Ooh, that sucks. Ten more seconds. Five, four, three, two. Nice job. All right, let's go side plank. We'll go in three, two, one. Let's go. Twenty seconds to go. Fifteen. Ten more seconds. Five, four, three, two. Woo! Time. Good job. All right. Let's switch sides. <clears throat> we'll go in five, four. Three, two, one, let's get it. Oh, I might modify. Well. Nice job, you guys. Ten more seconds. Three, two, one. Oh my gosh. Let's finish off one more front plank. I think we can do it. And then I will let you guys go. Shake it out. Get ready for it. Whew. We'll go in five, four, three, two, one. Last plank. 60 seconds. Hold it. You got it. Nice job, you guys. Really good job today. Thirty more seconds. Oh, my God. Woo! <laughs> uh, Twenty-five to go. 20. Oh my God. 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two. You are all done at the 49 minute mark. Good job. Woo. 